Well, hello everyone, and welcome to Empire Total War. Today we're doing a battle celebrating the 4th of July. So we have an army of the United States of America going up against a force from Great Britain. So, I know what you're thinking. Alex, you're, you're, not, you're not American. Why are you celebrating the uh, 4th, of, 4th of July? Well, I just thought it would be quite fitting, seeing as I actually have a game which we can do these kind of battles in this kind of time period. I think it'd be pit the factions against each other. I am just playing against the AI, and I am playing as America, so I'm going against uh, everything that I stand for as an Englishman, <laughs> and I'm rooting for American independence. No, I'm just kidding. Um, so I'm playing as the I'm playing as the United States, as I didn't really want to lose this battle, um, so and I couldn't really exactly show the battle with the United States. Uh, sorry, with the United States losing, uh, the United Kingdom. Will hopefully lose this battle. Uh, this is a battle replay, so yeah, we're just going to see how we get on in this battle. Uh, so we have a pretty standard force here. So we've got some units of line infantry. Also, happy Fourth of July. Hope you're all having fun and celebrating it if you're in the US. And if you're in the UK, you are hard luck. But we still got our tea. You didn't sink all of that, so you can never have enough tea. Uh, we do have a unit from the 1st Maryland here, the 1st Regiment of Maryland. Uh, we also have some more line infantry. I do really love the details in Empire. The fact that you can actually have like uh, the drummers and the officers and the flag sounds. Can you listen to that? Oh! And our artillery is also firing now. Reloading now. So the details in Empire Total War are really nice. Um, it's just a shame that it was really buggy on launch. And yeah, it kind of got a bit of a bad rap for that. But I think it is... I, I played this for hours upon end when it first was released. Uh, so I had a lot of fun with it. As you can see, I'm mainly just stay, staying stationary at the minute. While we kind of draw in the United Kingdom's forces. Cannon firing once again. The drums from the UK are a rolling. Oh. There we go. So they, uh, their army's kind of made up of line infantry here. A unit of the Black Watch. Oh, he's changed his song. You keep drumming, sir. You keep drumming. Oh, there we go. The mortars... And now firing, sorry, the howitzers. Didn't really take any out. Oh, we took out. There we go. So the, the English general's having a bit of a run for it now. Doesn't want to stick around there. Don't blame him. Oh, a signpost. An empty one. Well, very nice. Some more units of line infantry here. And it appears the cavalry, the US Regiment of Horse, have beaten off a unit of light, light, uh, life guards. And are now going to be running on in to the unit of light infantry here. Uh, the dragoons, the light dragoons actually got off quite a few shots um, when I was doing it live. But here we go. Regiment of Horse charging on in. The light infantry trying to leg it. <laughs> but not very successfully. Now I'm just going to pause this battle just for a sec while we turn this, turn the music back up. Yes, uh, yeah, well, there aren't really any hills around. Oh, and some light horse come in to save their comrades here. There's some lifeguards, not light horse. Are uh, going up against the regiment of horse, and that's probably going to go one way for the United States here, and that's badly. So we'll leave that engagement for now, as I think the main lines are going to start firing pretty soon. So we've got some rangers here, and they are taking some pot shots at the unit of line. And this isn't using any mods, by the way. I was in a... Again, at the minute, I really do not have a lot of free time. Um, so I wasn't able to install Darth mod. And this is a fairly new computer. I haven't actually installed a whole lot. So firing off the canister here. Line infantry now firing. Fire by rank. Yes, sir. Oh, okay. So, cavalry going out around the flanks. 
The UK getting some pot shots back. But my line is a lot more organised and I managed to fire off canister shot as well. Continuing to fire and the canister as well. So the line infantry is in a bit of disarray with the United Kingdom here. In go the howitzer shots. Oh, taking out some more of the general's bodyguard. My light dragoons are firing off into the black watch. The regiment of horse. I think I actually might lose this engagement. But here we go. My main lines are still firing. Tearing shreds into that unit of line infantry. So they're lifeguards. Oh no, just a regiment of horse this time. We're trying to get in amongst the legion of the United States, and that can't happen. Yes, it, trumpeteer. Trumpet away, sir. Trumpet away. Houses firing in once again. But we're kind of... Oh, oh, the grenadiers firing into the foot artillery. Line infantry trying to go in and fend off the grenadiers. But the artillery has taken quite a few shots there. And the grenadiers are still firing their stuff. And that is killing quite a few. Yeah, that unit of artillery is pretty much wiped out. So, the battle for the United States' freedom continues. So I'm just starting to take some casualties now with the line infantry. This was just against an AI, and no one was really around when, at the time, I was playing this battle. But nevertheless, hopefully, it's enjoyable. Okay, I think they're reloading, but they're now going to get shot in the back here. And the still kind of the, the fire by rank. I really do like that. But we are kind of pretty much routing them across the board. So my line has pretty much stayed intact. Uh, the Legion of the United States has taken a lot of casualties now though. The line infantry formed a bit of a square to fend off any cavalry assaults. But now it's time for the US to start pushing forward. Line infantry going forward to try and take out the Black Watch. Are you? Or are you just... I'm not really sure what's going on. Uh, but here we have a melee battle. Some line infantry going up against the United States there. Defend the flag, sir. Defend the flag. Let's go into slow-mo. See the attack. Waha! Didn't look like you you died, but you did there. I think for a game that came out in 2009, the graphics are still pretty um, up to scratch. This is on Ultra. Stab! But here we go. The unit of line infantry reloading. Oh, where's the flag bearer, though? <gasps> I think he's dead. I think the flag bearer's died. No! I do really like the music in Empire. I'll probably get a copyright claim, though. <laughs> so the Black Watch is still holding. The drummer is a drummering. The artillery is still firing to my units. We are taking out some line infantry here. I think they've routed. So the first Maryland, they're pretty much still intact. They have lost a few men though. Oh, 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 okay. Well, they lost quite a few more now. Uh, I think that was a shot <laughs> of canister. So this is kind of where they're starting to make their last stand almost. So we have ranks upon ranks of US line infantry. Taking some fire against the Brits here. Yes. Charge on in, sir. 
Charge on in. That's it. Attack with the flag. But I think that's pretty much... Oh, and the enemy general has also been pelished. Sorry, he's, he's died. And the final one, the final officer, appears to be no more. Bummer. And with that, I think the, the United Kingdom's army is pretty much going to rout. And there we have it. So, that was my little battle for independence. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And happy 4th of July to all you Americans out there. It, uh, it took a lot for me to <laughs> have to defeat the United Kingdom. But it is the 4th of July, so uh, I'll give it to you fellas. We've gone for an historical loot today. Lots of cheering. Lots of celebrating. The army from the United Kingdom, across the board, just got absolutely trounced. Oh! No. Oh no, they're coming back. They're coming back. They're routing. They are steady. Oh yes, this is the final stand of the Brits. So... We're going to charge in on their artillery. But. They're kind of flanking in behind me. But now my general's getting on the action. And as you can see, we've got some uh, house of fire coming in. And the general. Getting on the action now. And has routed the final unit of infantry. There we go. The United States forces. Butchering the final men from the United Kingdom. And with that, I guess America has secured its independence. So, there we have it. And every oh everyone's frozen because the battle has ended. There we go. God, it's been a while since I've played Empire Total War. Not sure how much I'll play it in the future on the channel, uh, but hopefully you enjoyed this little video. Apologies if the commentary was a bit off. I haven't really been recording much recently, and I guess, I'm, I guess I need to kind of warm up. Although I am quite warm in my room. It's quite warm today. But there we go. Happy Fourth of July, everyone. Hope you all have a very nice day, and until next time everyone, I bid you a very, very good day.